Hello there, welcome to Get Data Solution. Today we are going to see dynamic sales by employee and by location. Here we have a table that contains the data, and here we have a chart which actually shows the, the sales performance by individual employee with their amount just to construct this uh, we have used these seven steps so uh, first of all we'll see how this uh, dynamically change and it is interactivity then we'll construct a similar chart together following those uh, steps I have shown you so uh, here is the instruction. The instruction says uh, insert the location, insert employee and sales amount in the data. So we'll fill the data, then we'll construct this. So let's look at this interactivity. If I select the first uh, location, it will actually display both uh, in the table and on the chart the performance of that location if i select the second location again here it shows the data for sec uh, that location third location again the data is displayed for that particular location then the next then the last so this is very interactive so uh, we'll construct this uh, dynamic uh, sales chart together just before that here is the benefit of this it is easy and convenient to enter data and it automatically updates sales and automatically generates sales charts with their achievement it can save time and avoid manual cal calculation is also actually helpful to follow up sales performance here this is recommended for sales managers branch managers sales team or sales persons as well as business organization as well as small uh, business owners can use this system to just follow up their business so as you have seen it is very interactive so let's construct together similar chart just to do that first of all let me copy the steps on the and paste on new sheet and again copy the data from this sheet and paste on new sheet so first of all let me actually add the heading this is location this is employee and sales I have added the heading so let me actually uh, follow these steps to construct the chart the first one is add the heading to add the heading simply I control and T with the heading yeah that is added the next is removing band draws uh, to do that I'll go to table design and here it is uh, ticked I'll untick it and it has gone. The third step is add slicers. I'll go to insert and add slicer. And this time I select the location. So uh, the location is added here then the next one is i select employee and sales and insert 
bar chart so I will select this go to recommended chart and insert bar chart here the chart is ready now so um, I'll format it and the gap which is 220 format data and make the gap which is 220 so the gap which is uh, ready I will add the title now sales by employee so the next one is to add uh, colors so I'll go to the format go to field and add with I will select the option that says, says vary colors by point so it has been added now so uh, then I will actually uh, can check it so let me actually select the location here if I select the first location it displays only the data for that particular location then the next then the next then the next for the whole let me expand it here so uh, let me check again uh, so we have uh, constructed our chart following these steps and as I've already mentioned and indicated this chart can be actually uh, very good to track uh, sales performance and this is recommended for sales managers branch managers sales persons business organization and small business owners so um, that's all for today we have seen a very important topic where we can actually able to construct sales which, uh, which shows the performance by location and by employee so thank you very much for coming to this channel and if you are actually new to this channel please consider subscribing to our channels and see you in the next video similar video uh, where we can actually come up with uh, other uh, tool to track uh, either project or business and bye-bye.